Okay, hello everyone, and welcome to my new Let's Play of Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. Uh, this is a blind Let's Play. This is not... This was just a... This only happened because, uh... Well, I recorded a first part, but the audio was all broken and stuff, so I went I'm gonna go ahead and delete that. I have a new one. As always, I'm going to call myself Archer. Uh, there was an opening thing that was telling the story of like a goddess and the sky and some monkeys and stuff. Anyway, that apparently didn't decide to come back on. I turned it on this time, so you know we missed that, but you still get to see this sandworm right here. He's yawning. He's tired. He's a bleeding ruin, I guess. I don't know, that or he just has crazy hair. Anyway, one thing. Uh, first matter of business, I would like to apologize to my subscribers. Firstly, because uh, I stopped doing the Twilight Princess Let's Play. Uh, I did that because I had... My mic had broken, and so I got a new one. That one... That one wasn't recording audio very loudly, so... Uh, I just had pretty much 20 parts of silence, so I'm gonna get around to re-recording that at some point, but that'll be a lot of work, so... Anyway, these are ducks, and kids are jumping off cliffs. Or at least one of them died. Uh, yeah, this is blind after the first ten minutes or so. Or half an hour, I guess. That's how long my parts are going to be this time. Uh, I also want to apologize because in my Twilight Princess Let's Play, I uh, called Midna a midget repeatedly. Uh, that was insensitive to people who actually are midgets. And, uh, so, I'm sorry for that. Didn't mean to offend anyone, and I hope that I won't offend anyone during this Let's Play. Uh, I meant to say munchkins. I was thinking of the creatures from Wizard of Oz. I was just saying midgets because I'm an idiot. Anyway, Link is dreaming. Well, we all know what happens when Link dreams. He wakes up with a really stupid face. And there's a sandworm. And someone turned on the lights. Dave, you missed your cue! Guys, I'm sure the time's meant for you to awaken. I'm sleepy! Wait a minute. Link's awakening? Is that the wind fish? Tell me to wake up. I'm like, I don't want to wake up. And then there goes the wind fish again. Dark wind fish of doom and death and doom. Duck! So, Link has been awakened by a duck. Isn't that lovely? There's a duck in my window. Get out of here, duck. No one likes you. Oh, uh, that's fine. Just staring at him, then vomits a letter. Anywho... Zelda's complaining about how I sleep in, which seems to be one of Link's only character traits. Uh, so yeah, Zelda. She was playing a harp earlier. She gave that note to the bird. She signed it. Or at least wrote her name. I don't know if she signed it. I can't exactly see the pensmanship writing on it. Anyway. This is slightly less blind for the first half hour or so, because I know that this is a door, for example. Last time I wandered around for a bit and wound up in the restroom. Why they have a random restroom is beyond me, but it seems like a kind of pointless room to have in a game like this. I guess they're just going for realism or something. Anyway, this is Skyloft! Yay! Got a big old statue of a fat lady. 
And then you can do a dash now instead of rolling, which I think is pretty cool. Other than then, how it's a certain amount of stamina. But, I mean, he can run up walls now, so that's cool. I want to ignore you! I know how to Z-target, I've done this 20 million times! Yeah, shut up. 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 I'm not even saying words anymore. This is what you've done to me, tall guy. Shut up. Tall guy, shut up. Just explaining running stuff. It's auto jump, ha ha, I'm so clever, that's never been in a Legend of Zelda game before. Uh, he's telling me to go find, to... I have to go meet Zelda, so I'm telling him about it. Uh, he wants me to get his pet named Mia. And his pet is freaking adorable. It's up there. Freaking adorable. Like, I would happily kill Zelda's dad to get it because... He's named after the Owl for no green of time. Oh, that sucks. Because the Owl sucks. It's annoying, it's pointless, and creepy. Anyway, run to the wall, grab a shelf that's here for no apparent reason. Oh, really, why is there just like a little shelf here? Who actually designed a building like this? Climbing! <laughs> Shut up, tall guy! Yes, I know, okay? I know how to get up there. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Thank you. Link is a slow person. Right, this thing is adorable! We could dance on the rooftop all night long! I don't think you guys fully comprehend how cute this thing is. Look at it! Look at it! Look at it! It'll kill you! That's how cute it is! My first round through, I didn't. Act I forgot to bring it back to him. Mostly because I wanted to keep it. So, what happens for bringing it to this guy is nothing. Dude, I'm taking the lemur cap. I'm not throwing it. Stop it! I'm not throwing the lemur cap. You hold up the Wii remote to the like. I'm not throwing the lever cat off the edge! I love this lever cat! This is my lever cat brother! But I can't carry it past that, uh, doorway anyway, so... Be free, lever cat! I hope it can fly. Charge! So, uh, here's a statue. Looks like she has feathers for hair. Because it's not all that weird. Not in the Legend of Zelda game, anyway. And there's Zelda, playing on her lyre. Being Zelda E. And it's like, oh, you killed her. Zelda's a good singer, unlike Milan. And that sounds like it'd actually be a really cool song if it had lyrics. And actually, it sounds like she's speaking in Japanese when she sings. So. Yeah, so. Uh. Yeah. She's got a funny outfit and a uh, liar. 
a liar, not a harp. Zelda's being a liar, not the kind that she's playing, but she's lying about the liar. Not the kind that she is, but the kind she's playing. The first time I said great, so this time I'm gonna say, uh... Ha ha ha. I made her self-conscious! I'm a jerk! And Dwayne's just standing there like, Yep, I said that. Well, her Link looks so dopey in these games. And there's her father, who's named after an owl and based on Roru. And his, his face looks like an owl, though. Look at those eyes. The man will kill you. Plus, he's really, really tall. Not that I have anything to to tall people. I'm tall. Yeah. But given that I'm tall, it's kind of weird seeing people who are taller than me. In this case, I'm Link, so... Is like twice my height. Kind of freaking me out. He is just like the owl from Ocarina of Time, really, because he's giant. And I think he wants to eat someone. Anyway, we're talking about birds. He's talking about how all the people in Skyloft have ducks. And those ducks are like they're nothing really, they're just ducks. Apparently they're special in some way. They're like the, uh, the things from that Avatar movie. You know, the things that fly. I'm abandoning this joke now. Anyway, we're talking about flying and instruction and how Zelda has absolutely no faith in me and how Link's wearing makeup. Time has come to talk of ships and kings and whether or not pigs have wings. Pigs totally do have wings, by the way. Anyone who says otherwise hasn't been paying very much attention. But I forget them. <laughs> oh ho! Zelda's yelling at her dad because she doesn't think that I can win. Well, she doesn't think I'm gonna be a knight. Well, too bad, Zelda! If I couldn't become a knight, then I wouldn't be able to progress with the game, so of course I'm gonna be a knight! But anyway, I have to find my bird. Because my bird's not here. And now Zelda's gonna push me off the cliff. You know, good times. There's a cliff. And now she pushes me off it. Yep, my uh, bird's not down there. I'm gonna fall to my death. Anyway, <gasps> fall to my death! Whee! You don't actually have to press the button. It's just a cutscene. So. <laughs> and Rory's all like, yeah, there's no bird, lol. And so Zelda's like, oh, well then, I practically just killed Link. Great. Anyway, uh, near-death experience. Yay. And injury of a riding animal. Same way that Twilight Princess started out. Now I have to go find my bird. Yeah, well, I forgive you, Zelda, because you actually have somewhat of a personality in this game, so it's all good. I'm gonna see if I can go find the cat monkey thing. I mean, the cat monkey. The thing is freaking adorable, and I want to hug it. Oh, so that one dude wants me to. 
anyway, this old dude is telling me to go talk to that one tall dude so I can tell him that my bird is dead and so I can't fly. And Zelda's pointing out how that's redundant because if I were to ask the guy to postpone the ceremony, then he'd just ask that guy if he could postpone the ceremony and... Well, it's all very redundant, so I don't see why we don't just postpone the ceremony. Charge Link! You just saw it. Please fruit uh recharge your charge. Hey listen, bro, I need you to let give me a little bit longer to find the bird, because it's not here. And the tall dude's all like, I die! <laughs> He's gonna go talk to the owl. Uh, I'm gonna go try and find my bird. Yeah, if I had tried to go any further than that, kid would have stopped me. Anyway, there's a sky stag beetle. It's different from a regular stag beetle in that it has sky in the name. And I found a blue rupee. Hello. Oh, let's oh, uh, This is where I stopped on the first one through, so. We all cut up now, it's completely blind from here on out. I'm gonna try going up this way. Look up this way. Curtain. Oh! I agree with you. I bet my birdie's down there. Birdie! Where's my duck? Oh. I don't want to go flying off the edge. Not yet, because I don't have a bird in Okay, if you have blood sucking monsters, I can tell. I'm not a kid. I'm Link. I'm guessing my bird's not there. Must find bird! Your statue of bird? Who we'll killed your statue of bird? Am I the only one who thinks that this looks an awful lot like the owl statues from Twilight Princess? I don't think it does. Anyway, I should find my bird. Birdie. Hey, birdie. How do you call it duck? A quack, I guess. Hey, birdie. Quack, I guess. This place seems to have something like on top of it, so I'm gonna go see if I can find that. Uh, person! I don't know who that is. She'll never learn unless she runs into trouble one day. Yeah, that probably means she's run into trouble and she's gonna die. And I have to save her life. Kind of predictable. It's not it's supposed to be a sort of dramatic irony. Are you I'm guessing not. Oh, by the way, that's me. Yeah. My special friend today. Oh dear. He's dating a monster, just like that one. Just like that one girl from Wind Waker. Oh, I love Metalus. 
Old people are complaining. Oh, if you're hoping to get me to do it for you. Yeah. I wanted to get up. I'm gonna go to the light tower. Let's off your maps. I'm going to win, obviously. Oh, I see that. I figured that's probably my best guess for where my bird is. Oh dear, there's some ugly people. It's nice and ugly, I can't see people. You know, Bruce, that sure was a pain, what with all the scratching and pecking. <laughs> oh yeah, they get nothing. Also, you got a big person. Yep, I'm the person one because it's rare. And what is up with your face? I was right, they are ugly. <laughs> They're so ugly, I could kick them. And no good to back away. So, uh, yeah, just how long have you been standing there? Long enough! <laughs> What's your problem anyway? Oh, wait, I got you were here talking about days. Great! I can see it in those dopey eyes of yours. With Lady Oh, Bruce, can you please find it in your heart to let me win today, please? Yeah, he's being fun. <laughs> please keep your face away from me. Please. You don't see my How come I don't see your bird? Huh? <laughs> nice hair. <laughs> that really is a stupid looking hairdo. It's like not even curled up at the top, it's just like a shark. Everyone knows where I've got the slickest pompadour in town. Oh, you're kidding. We're all getting tired of how you never let him into the room himself, but I go way back. I haven't said anything. Shh. Go back, though. Dude, I, you're twice my size, and I just insulted your hair. Hehehe. <laughs> I was here to kill him. Murder time! He's picking on me! You just got told, son! Oh, well, I'm glad that I found where my bird is. Or at least I found some progress of some sort. I'm quite certain it's at the top of the lighthouse. Tower. Whatever. I can totally get my bird. You're not going to spot any trace of my bird, you're just going to fly in circles and be useless. So, I'm on my own for finding the duck. Time to climb up the ladder! Time to climb up another ladder! Uh... 
around the gods of sun, and then the lights radiant and come to a chosen mm-hmm. Cryptic things! Probably <laughs> unadvisable to die. I like my position up here. And since we're getting close to a half an hour, I'm gonna go ahead and stop it here. So I'll see you guys next time. Bye.